you just need only one ingredient to make something quick easy and very delicious and tasty for dinner do not go away because you will definitely need this after a long day or a tiring day from work do not go away hello lovely youtube family how is it going i trust everyone is doing great it's your girl claudie welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel this is cooking with claudie right here and if you're new here he is special welcome to you and trust me you're gonna love every recipe i drop on here but do not go away if you haven't yet subscribed please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and trust me any recipe i drop here is gonna be the best you will ever ever see so guys let us drop on our start off with the ingredients we will be needing right here i'm using one whole fish scaled and gutted perfectly washed the fish i'm using here is sea bream but you must not use sea bream you can use any fish of your choice i will start first by taking off all the fins then score the fish and let's get ready to season So the ingredients I'm going to be using is Tex-Mex, Texan Mexican um, ingredient or seasoning. It has spices and herbs. It has like some vegetables. It has onion, garlic, green pepper, red bell pepper, some jalapenos. Just imagine like all combined together in one. This one already has salt and if you want extra salt you can add it but the salt is just okay and it also has like a beyond type of taste like this kind of beyond cubes taste is just okay you don't need to add any other ingredients there so i will apply some oil here and just because i love black pepper on my fish i'm going to put some freshly cracked black pepper on it but you can skip this part if you want to like i said before this recipe does not need salt because the tex-mex ingredient already has salt you can get tex-mex from amazon or any grocery store So you can grill right away. Let it broil or grill on the oven 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 8 minutes each side. I'm using 8 minutes because my fish is not that big. So while my fish is grilling, I will be using some french fries for my side. It's gonna be a perfect dinner guys after a long day at work. So guys, I will season my fries with still some of that Tex-Mex. If you haven't yet tried Tex-Mex guys, you should go in for it look at that it's looking so beautiful i'll just flip the sides then apply some of that text mix on the other side and let it grill again the oven for about eight minutes 400 degrees fahrenheit as normal i'll apply a little bit of oil here because i want to keep my fish very moist throughout grilling and after eight minutes our fish is fully cooked ready to serve i told you guys it's a quick one quick one for sure super tasty delicious guys i never ever knew tex mex like it was so perfect for fish i thought tex mex was only for chicken but when i tried the first time for fish it was amazing so what i'm rubbing on here is just some of the tex mex with a little bit of olive oil so yeah look at that 
something quick for dinner guy guys i got you guys with any fish recipes all my fish recipes are quick ones for sure look at that it's so crispy in the outside and trust me it's gonna be 100 percent moist and juicy in the inside let us see how it's looking Oh my god, sea bream is one of a very nice fish. So good. You have sea bream, red snapper, sea bass, mackerel, salmon. Those are very good fish. So guys, this is the end of the video. Thank you so much. I hope I saved the day for someone. And to meet again in my next video, bye for now. Keep trusting my recipes. Thanks for the likes, the share, and everything. See you in my next video. Bye-bye. And lastly, please stay safe.